Hello, it's Wumples here. Today we're going to be setting up Disco Diffusion to uh, give you a little bit more detail and speed things up. So the first thing we're going to do is uh, drop down the menu for one setup and we're just going to click on one one check GPU status and make sure you're connected to a Tesla T4. This shouldn't be too difficult on free and pro accounts for the most part. But uh, if you leave it running overnight or for like 50 renders on the free account on the T4, you're gonna run out of uh, you're gonna run out of GPU time pretty quick, and you're gonna be locked out for a day or two. So, so after you're uh, connected for a T4 and you get your one and two settings going, we're gonna go down into the basic settings. We're gonna change the clip guidance. We're gonna bump that up to 10,000. We're going to change the cut in batches down to one instead of four. Now that's going to speed up your render time quite a bit. And uh, the next thing we're going to do is go down to the extra settings here. We're going to change ETA to 0 0.1 and the clamp max we're going to change to 0 0.09. Uh, th well, those two those two settings are mainly to speed things up. And now for cut-in scheduling, these changes are going to be for increasing your details. So a uh, cut overview, we're going to change it to settings. I'm going to I'm going to type them out in the description below, and you can copy and paste the settings you're going to change for the cut overview and cut inner cut, and also the cut underscore IC underscore POW we're gonna bump that up to 10 and that's gonna increase your details quite a bit so just those settings alone you're gonna notice more detail and you're gonna notice a much faster render times all right thanks for watching